Good morning everyone! It's December 1st, which means it is the first day of Vlogmas. Um, I'm sort of nervous about this because I am kind of a boring person. Uh, um, but I figured I'd go ahead and do this and uh, we'll just figure it out as we go. So I just woke up and jumped in the shower. My hair is still wet. I'm not really wearing any makeup. I put eyebrows on for you guys because and mascara because I look like a naked mole rat without them. Um, so basically uh, the very first thing I do in the morning is pet stuff. That's what I do most of the day actually. So I'm gonna go ahead and go walk the dogs and then we'll deal with the stuff behind me. You gotta go potty. <laughs> See what the little man is up to. Bear sleeps in his crate at night because he gets into things while we're sleeping. Hi, buddy. Hi, little man. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Hi, good morning. Hello. Do you have to go potty? Yep, everybody's got to go potty. All right, let's go. Come on. All right, so I'm back from walking the dogs, and um, I figured before I jumped into the pet stuff that I would sort of um, explain my thoughts on Vlogmas and my plans for what will happen on this channel. And um, so far the plan is is that I'm not going to be vlogging every single day, but there's going to be a video every single day. So my plan is is to keep my one upload a week a standard video and then I'll have the other six uploads that week be vlogs or fun clips or something but my plan for vlogmas isn't so much to vlog every day as much as it is to get a video out every day so um, one day you might come to my channel and find a full vlog one day you might come to my channel and find a cage tour it's totally going to depend on what's going on that week um, I know with Christmas coming up there is a chance I'm gonna have to pre-film some stuff for the holidays and things like that. So, um, I'm drifting downward I think. I'm totally new to this vlogging thing. So, uh, with that being said, I'm gonna make myself breakfast real quick, uh, which I don't think you guys need to see. You might want to see it. I'm just making a really unhealthy breakfast sandwich. Um, and then I will clean the guinea pig cage and give them their pellets for the morning and stuff like that. You'll have to excuse uh, Mount Everest on my forehead. I get hormonal breakouts and I'm sure it will not be the first or last pimple you see on my face during this process. I also want to just explain... Um, You'll probably see it behind me in a lot of the clips. Right now I've got my back facing a semi-clean area of my apartment, but my apartment right now is a mess, and hopefully I'll be able to explain why that is um, in a little bit, but we are moving things around a lot. And five of the pets got new cages, which you got a glance of at the very beginning of this video. So uh, the aftermath of that is pretty epic and then when we put up the new cages we actually decided to um give all of the pets the den that they're in right now um originally they were sharing it with my boyfriend's office but my boyfriend's office is going to be moving 
to our dining room and it's it's a whole big thing that you guys um will probably see most of today is going to be me cleaning a little bit to get ready for that um even though i don't think we're really going to move everything until the weekend because he works night shift um but just getting ready for all of that is going to be my chore today so this video won't be super interesting but um it'll be it'll be what it is you'll see all right you'll find out when i find out so i'm gonna go eat breakfast and then we'll do um pet stuff hey little dudes what you doing hi your cage is super mucky oh my oh my goodness look at this mucky cage oh lord how do you guys even manage this all right so um <clears throat> first thing i do really is i refill their hay rack which is always empty in the morning um they do eat some of what they pull out but not not most of it you'll have to excuse the the spray so we'll just uh We'll set you guys up here. Don't knock over this camera. Don't you knock it over. <laughs> Hi. Hello. What is that? <laughs> beep beep. I spilled that all over the floor. Oh yay mommy. Go. Yummy. Here. It's all over your back. Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to scare you. What you doing? You got a little bit of hay on your face. All right, so now we're just gonna... Hey, don't eat that. Excuse you, that's not for you. So I'm just gonna spot clean this area first, give them their pellets and then do the rest of the cage. Hey, don't the bug in this, silly butt. pellets and then vacuum the rest of the cage while they're down here munching and doing their thing so there we go we'll shut these doors some stray poops that are tucked in there so we'll get those okay put in the clean pad and their tunnel goes back in this tunnel is seen better days for sure but um we're gonna keep using it until until we can't anymore i guess <laughs> so this is arwen's cage and um what i do with the hamsters in the morning is honestly not very much i'm just gonna resituate some of this bedding sort of pull through what she has knocked into the bars, resituate it so that this pan is covered. Um, 
because this this pan doesn't have um, like a lip on it or anything like that which is fine because I don't put much bedding in it to begin with and they don't really go to the bathroom up here but I just want to make sure that's all situated her water bottles there in case you know you're curious and then we'll just I just sort of check everything I've got a fleece cover on this so I like to make sure that um, she hasn't chewed anything because if she does I have to take it off but she hasn't which is good she is sleeping in there and uh, yeah that's that's about it I don't want to wake her up so I'm not gonna bug her um, so her food bowl still has food in it so I'm not gonna refill it um, for those of you who don't know I only refill the hamster bowls when nothing is in them to avoid picky eating and then we'll just do the same in Lumi's cage they both s sorta dig in the front corner um, probably from standing in the front and Lumi likes these hay mats she doesn't have much up here because um, I need to make or buy her like a house or something um, and I need an extra bowl to give her a different sand bath um, <clears throat> but she's got a water bottle up here and she spends a lot of time chewing on these mats she really likes those so she's got two of them right now that you can see she spends a fair bit of time just chewing them apart this one I've trimmed um, but yeah she likes those and then she's got some chew toys and she is in that igloo back there. There's her sand bath. And we'll just make sure that she hasn't been chewing the ramp cover, which she hasn't. And uh, her food bowl is empty, so I'll go ahead and take that. And we'll go refill it. And I gotta make sure that I keep this door closed because we have a nosy kitty. So let's go refill her bowl. So their food is still out here even though they aren't. That's their old bins there, um, both of them. So basically this whole shelving unit is going to be moved. Um, it actually isn't coming with us on the move. I'm gonna go ahead and give it to my mother. Um, so she can use it in her garage, I think. Uh, but, yeah. So, their food is still out here. We're actually running low on food. Um, not too, too bad. But I've got to pick up some more this weekend. And... We'll give her extra oxbow since we're running low on on her original mix. See, as you can see, there's boxes laying around and stuff like that. Everything's sort of a mess right now. Um, I'll put that in there. So that when she wakes up, she'll get it. Lumi does have two water bottles. Um, I wanted to give Arwen two. I probably will, but... So, I've got a second glass one for her, but I can't find the, um, I know where the, the, like, spring part is, but I don't know where the, this little wire bit is, so I'm probably gonna end up using, like, a zip tie or something, um, but I haven't gotten around to messing with it just yet, so, you know, they each have these ones here, these plastic ones, so I'm not super concerned about it right now. So, so there isn't much to do um, maintenance wise for the Tenric until it's time for him to eat. Uh, but he didn't really eat last night. Yeah, he's still got some worms. So I will probably um, just leave that alone and maybe change his water. He is in here. I don't know if you can actually see him. 
Oop, too dark. You can sort of see him. He's out cold. <laughs> uh, it is, he is, he's not fully in torpor. He still gets up at night, but he sleeps very sound. Are you guinea pig watching? Huh? Is that your favorite sport? Yes. Excuse you. It's super crazy dark, but um, everybody's getting their food now. Uh, it's wild that it's already so dark because it's only 5.10, but uh, there's winter for you, I guess. Let's go see. Yeah, the sun's already setting. I can show you guys my crummy view. So the grounders have eaten and now um, the rest of the day is pretty relaxed until about 10 o'clock. Um, so I think I'm going to go ahead and get one of the hedgehogs out uh, so you guys can see them. They need baths today so you'll be able to get a couple quick clips of them. And then I think I'm going to end the vlog there uh, just because... The later it gets, the darker my apartment gets, so you won't be able to see much anyway. So, um, yeah, let's go say hi to the hedgehogs, and then I will probably just end up seeing you guys tomorrow. So, Drago's having a quick bath, and I'm going to trim his nails. I actually just put Blaze away and realized I didn't vlog him at all. But, uh, he was in a pretty crabby mood and spent most of the time in a blanket on my lap anyway. So, Draco's just gonna get a bath and, um, he is going to get his nails done. I'm not gonna film totally because I'm also catching up on YouTube videos, <laughs> uh, while I, while I do all this and I don't want a chance getting someone else's video in the shot or, uh, you guys being able to hear it or anything like that because, you know. So, uh, we will see you guys after the bath. Can you say bye? <laughs> and we're all done, and he's out of focus. It's too bright, I think. Hello. He just got his nails done, so he's, uh, super annoyed with me. Can you say hi? Say, nope, I'm in my burrito. I have no desire to say hello to anybody. There he is. <gasps> hello. Are you comfortable? You look comfy. <laughs> Where the trays meet, there's like a lump, and every day he uses it as a pillow. Oh, I woke him up. My bad, buddy. All right. I got um a little super worm here for Draco. He's never had super worms before, so we'll see how he feels about it. He usually eats mealworms. Ooh. Here you go, Baba. Go ahead. <laughs> He's like, let me go to bed, Mom. Wait, you smell something? <laughs> Did you change your mind? Ha, <laughs>
You gotta, you, you gotta go in your cage. You can't, you can't wander off. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna cut the vlog off here. There's still a bunch of stuff I do in the evening, like feeding everyone. Um, but this isn't a daily routine video. <laughs> so I figure you guys don't need to see that. Tomorrow will probably be a veggie time video because I haven't done one of those in a long time with the pigs. Um, so that'll be exciting. But yeah, uh, I'm going to go ahead and call it a night. Uh, I hope to see you guys all tomorrow and every day for the rest of this month. And uh, yeah, happy vlogmas or something like that. <laughs> Bye!